welcome to my channel. I'm back. Uh, had an awesome time. At, uh, had an awesome time at the West Coast uh, hot sauce e experience. Um, brought back some hot sauces with me. Uh, mostly from uh, Inferno Inferno Farms, but I do have one that I'm going to take to work for my buddy, who is from Morocco, and it is Mikey V. Mikey V's and KDB Saucy's Moroccan Madness. So, hopefully, um, when I give it to him, I'll ask him if I can record his, uh, you know, his reaction when he checks it out. Um, see if I can find him. He's always running around somewhere, but uh, I'm definitely going to give it to him. If I can't review it or, or can I have him review it, well. But uh, well, he can tell me later. I'll let you guys know. But yeah, that's the one I want to check out today. Is because I'm out of sauces, and this one looks good. It's called Infernal Farms Illuminati. Um, yeah. So the ingredients are um, roasted peppers, red peppers, uh, water, salt, citric acid. Okay, Carolina Reaper pepper, pineapple juice, apple cider vinegar, fresh lemon juice, onion, black garlic, roasted garlic, ginger root, sea salt, and avocado oil, and then spices. So, yeah. I got my little knife here. Test it out. See what it... Oh, My rusty knife. Okay. Yeah, I'm out of hot sauce for work, so I figured I might as well open up and do a little review. Okay. Shake it up. Okay. You're good. good. It's kind of thick. How's it look? Mm. Okay. Brown color. Thick. Not really thick. It's medium. Here it goes. Oh. It has some kick to it. I can taste the reaper, the tip of my tongue. Mm. I don't know what I could put this on, but I'm gonna put it on any, everything. It's pretty good. Taste wise, flavor, flavor. I'd give it a seven. I don't know what I'm tasting. I don't taste the pineapple. Mostly the reaper. Filling in my mouth, getting a mouth burn. Heat wise, <clears throat> maybe a two for chili head, non chili head, probably eight. Uh, so, yeah. But, yeah, guys, I had a good time in uh, San Diego. San Diego got to meet all my, uh, my uh, fellow chili heads um, from the League of Fire. It was awesome. Uh, I finally got to meet uh, Red Grizzly. Um, He's super cool. Grizzly Heat. Check out his channel if you can. A um, <clears throat> bunch of other ones. I'm trying to think. Mm. Like a deer with the headlights. Um, oh, uh, Ryan and Liella from uh, uh, Today's Adventure. They were cool. Those were the first two people we met. Um, the first two couples, actually. It was Red and his wife. and uh, um, Ryan and Liella, they were awesome. We had a good time. Went to a bunch of stores, went to the zoo, but all the animals were sleeping at the time we went, so, um, yeah, but, um, the, I'm, I'm actually, 
I was pretty happy with myself, the, the results of the, the contest. Um, honestly, I didn't think I was going to last one or two rounds, maybe. Just because when I do review the peppers, the super hot, it ramps up. And after like five minutes, I'll let it, like the video record for five minutes. It, um, it just, I need like wah, milk and to bring it down. The heat stays up there. So I'm thinking I'm going to be in, do 10 rounds of this. I don't know. But it was, what was weird is, I think it was probably the adrenaline. When I was up there, the heat would go up to like 80%. And then while the Greg Foster was talking, Greg and uh, Shahina, the Chili Queen, were talking, it would go down to like maybe 40. And I kept on going with each pepper. So I was like, nice. I got this. But uh, what got me was that, that hot sauce. I think it was in the ninth, no, eighth. I'm not sure which, um, which um, uh, round it was. Um, yeah, then after that hot sauce, it left the, the burning rubber taste. The first hot sauce they gave me, it was actually pretty good. But the, the, the second one that I had, it burnt rubber taste. And I was able to finish uh, three, seven pots. I think there were seven pots after, after I had to chug. Um, so then, I don't know, um, I just like, my brain's like, yeah, you, you're not going to do this. You, you're gonna it's slowing you it slowed you it slowed you down so I had like two more rounds to go and I'm like eh I'm done and I just gave up like threw in a towel so sorry about that guys maybe next time if there's a next time I'll prepare more um to a bunch of hot sauce shots uh, with a bunch of extract and, but um my stomach was pretty good actually it, it um I didn't, I didn't get, well, I have that issue. I, I, I told a lot of people about it. I, I can't make myself uh, to the reversal of fortune, if you know what I mean. I was in the porta potty afterwards, and I'm looking bent over, looking down at a bunch of Mr. Mr. Hankies, and nothing. In my finger, my throat, nothing. So, yeah, I, I, I suffer for that one, you know, at the hotel. I won't get into details, but let's just say there was 10 hours, maybe, of moaning in the hotel room. Which hopefully everyone thought it was. Uh, <laughs> oh well, uh, I'm just messing with you guys. But yeah, it was like around I want to say 10, 10, 10 hours of cramping. So, but other than that, I had a wonderful time. Like I said, I got to meet a whole bunch of cool people that um, you know uh, were super nice to me and my girlfriend. Um, yeah, it was, it was awesome. And if I get the opportunity to go again, we'll definitely go. Um, yeah, just, just so wonderful um, to meet everyone. Jeff the fireman, um, Steve Berlin and his wife Michelle, so cool. He was rooting me on. He's like, you know, in the in the, the competition, he's like, you know, focus, focus, and I'm just like, ooh. <laughs> uh, but I, I guess uh, Michael from um, uh, the Never Better Club said it best. He says if you know the honorable way to go out in a pepper eating competition is either by um, going out in the, uh, the speed round because you made it all the way or booting your food up your body says nope so there's nothing, nothing you can do about that so since I didn't have that problem I was just afraid of the speed run I knew I, that, pe that hot sauce had slowed me down and I just like stopped it stopped me in my track so that's some good hot sauce this one right here, that's the one. I might order it just to practice with it in case I get called up to the to the show again. Uh, but I had a good time, guys. And uh, like I said, this hot sauce, like it's, it's a one or one or two on my heat scale. It's pretty good. Um, let's see. I don't know it says what you could put it on. Yeah, it gives you tongue lashing. The uh, the, the Carolina Reaper. So that's about it. Uh, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. I'll talk to you guys later. Have a nice one.